Now let's move to Lansing, where the year-long battle over COVID restrictions appears, however, slightly to be easing. Back in March, Rod Maloney sat down with Governor Whitmer for an extended interview on COVID and the legislature. Tonight, he's doing the same with the Senate Majority Leader Mike Shirky, who has been no stranger to controversial headlines this year either. Let's check in with Rod. Rod? Yeah, you know, Devin, uh, I've been calling this the Lansing Log Jam for quite a while now, but we have found out in the last week that the governor, after eight months, finally sat down face to face with the Republican leadership discussing ways to spend the federal dollars that are mounting there in Lansing. And when I spoke to the Senate Majority Leader, Mike Shirky, today, he said that those talks are cordial and confidential. Well, as far as I'm concerned, Rod, we should be opening up things right now. And one of the things we're exploring is what it's going to take for us to be able to do that. And uh, those conversations will continue. While willing now to sit down with Republican leadership, Governor Whitmer calls it maddening the Republican response and criticism regarding her trip to Florida last month. The leader says he's ignoring the criticism and wants to move forward. I'm glad the governor was able to go help her father. Uh, we all want that to have, uh, ability to be able to do so. But I can tell you there's thousands of families in Michigan who wanted to help their loved ones in nursing homes that were prohibited from being able to go and talk to them, walk with them, touch them, hug them, kiss them, whatever. Uh, and I think we now know that was uh, unnecessary restriction. Early on, extreme measures were taken to keep nursing homes as safe as possible, but Shirky believes they went on too long. And what's more, he says, thousands of Michigan residents have permanently closed. Shirky says he pulled legislation that would have imposed restaurant restrictions tougher than the governor's as an olive branch to her showing willingness to negotiate. We need to open things up. Businesses by this time, Rod, have figured out how to operate safely, protect their suppliers, protect their customers, protect their uh, vendors, protect their employees, and, uh, and everybody knows what to do and how to do it. And government needs to get out of the way. Now, the, we asked uh, Mr. Shirky about the governor and her decision not to shut Michigan down hard like she did last year during their most recent COVID surge. And he said that it really is evidence to him that the governor has not been using data and science all along. Back to you. And Rod, I know you also spoke about the new voter legislation that's on the mind of a lot of Michiganders right now. Yeah, we're going to be uh, talking to him uh, very much about that at 6 o'clock because uh, he says that there's a lot of, uh, well, things that are misunderstood about that law, and he wants to definitely talk about that. You've got it. All right, Rod, we will see you at 6.